The Department of Petroleum Resources is now called Nigerian Upstream Petroleum Regulatory Commission, NUPRC. The commission says its investigations reveal that petroleum products dealers are diverting petroleum products to unknown destinations. This is following the recent lingering panic buying of petroleum product in the state. Coupable to it have been sealed. We have sealed those stations. We can count the number of three of them that have been sealed. And uh, we are continuing to engage in such surveillance until normalcy return to the uh, petrol stations. Government has not increased the pump price. Government has no intention of um, um, scarcity. There's no scarcity at all. So the products are available. I can state categorically that as at today, the sufficiency level of the petroleum product are more than 20 days. Meanwhile, one of the petroleum marketers, however, disagreed with the NUPRC for sealing his fuel station. Some residents shared their experiences getting petroleum product in the past few days. The person that must have loaded who should have presented my DPR license to you, to the official that put this on the back, yes, on the shed, yes, should not produce my license for this station. Yes. We will not go to the union. To go and get the truck number, the, the, the truck. The first experience I had, that was last week. I was coming here to buy fuel. When I came in, I saw a, a, a queue. A, the queue was not much anyway. I was so surprised. Why should we have scarcity of fuel? Nigeria is not a country that's uh, supposed to have this kind of a, a, a experience. It is where, it's a country that is blessed by God. Understand? They, they always talk about subsidy. Every time we look around, somebody is talking about subsidy and move out. At the end of it, there's another round of subsidy, agitation and all that. So I, I, I'm fed up. I've given up. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.